Good morning, Rumba. So this morning, the kitchen was a mess. But I still continued to make lunches for the kids. I even got my laundry done. But I didn't have to drop the children off at school. That can only mean one thing. I'm no longer a single parent. Now as I unpack that idea, that notion, that sigh of relief, I know I'm gonna miss it. Tomorrow I get to go back to work. I finally get to have adult conversations and do a regular day of work without interruption, more or less. But there's still a ton of work that needs to be done at home uh, that I've put off for the last three weeks as I was uh, taking care of my two, four, and six year old. Uh, they take up a lot of time, as I've mentioned in previous vlogs. There's a lot that I need to do for them in order for them to have a smooth day, in order for them to get to school on time, in order to, for them to get the gymnastics. So that was the priority. So right now I'm headed off to get my eyes examined. Over the last few months, I've been noticing that my eyesight hasn't been what it used to be. And uh, I'm at the age where your eyesight starts to go downhill. I noticed it the most when I started shooting um, the vlogs uh, this month, when I started to have to edit uh, them on my on my laptop because I had to sneak in any time I, I could get to get those edits done. Even with my glasses on, and they're a couple years old, something has changed with my eyes. So I'm heading off to the optometrist uh, to see an eye doctor and get them checked out. So I'll probably be picking out some new glasses. Maybe I'll get some Ray-Ban Wayfarers like Casey Neistat. What do you guys think? At any rate, new glasses and eye maintenance is required today, along with getting my car service as well too. I haven't had a chance to do that, but mainly I just put it off because I wasn't sure if the weather would change for the worse. I'm getting my three season tires put on, I'm getting an oil change done, I'm getting a spring tune up on the vehicle. And this is all really important stuff because this is the vehicle that I use to cart my kids around. And they deserve to be in a safe vehicle. Plus I've noticed that the vehicle has been lagging off the line. I mean the 0 to 60 just wasn't what it used to be. So we need to get that taken care of as well too. Hey, I need to get the kids to school quickly, alright? Let's see how bad these old eyes are. Because I'm a daily vlogger now, I have to be in the smoothies or something. This is not a paid endorsement for booster juice. I just happen to be in the mall at the time getting my eyes checked. And now that I've gotten my eyes checked, I can't see anything on my phone. I can see for driving, but I can't even read my phone. I can't even see the screen, it's too small right now. I found out that I actually needed two pairs of glasses, one for regular wear and one for reading. Man, getting old is expensive. And the worst part is, the most comfortable set of glasses that I put on at the, uh, at the uh, optical place was the most expensive pair. That YouTube money better start rolling in fast. Pretty soon my kids are gonna need braces too. All right, just gonna go grab my laptop. Uh, service appointment for the car is gonna be at least a couple hours, so I'm gonna have to stay occupied. I know I probably can't even read the screen at the moment because those drops take like four to six hours for the effects to completely wear off. I'm just gonna bring my laptop and try to get some work done once my vision returns. Car's all finished up and service from the uh, Kia dealership. Uh, they did the oil change. I always get synthetic. I've had many vehicles with engines that uh, don't show their age because of my decision to go full synthetic. The other thing I had done was the um, was an alignment check. Although they went ahead and adjusted the uh, alignment anyway, but it wasn't really out of spec. It was like maybe 0.1 uh, in some of the uh, the categories, but they did it anyway and they charged me the full amount. Uh, luckily though, the service uh, person over there saw that, uh, you know what, this is probably something that 
uh, you could probably opt out of. It's not that big of a deal. I didn't say a whole lot, but the service uh, person was very understanding, and they actually ended up discounting most of the price of the uh, of the of the alignment, which I really appreciated. I mean, it wouldn't have been something that I would have even spent money on doing. Appreciate that um, that 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 help. Uh, I'll definitely be back to uh, have my vehicle serviced in the very near future. Thank you. And now I'm off to pick up the Fungros. Maybe they'll have a new top five list for me. Okay, and the Fung Bros are back. Hello, Jack Jack. Hello, Tai Tai. And what are your top five uh, foods that you like to eat? Number one. Number two. I like to rice. Number three. Start Number four. Like Number five. Sandwich. Sandwiches. And are those the top five things that the Fung Bros like to eat? Yeah. All right. All right, boys are home safe and sound. We've got dinner going on. And uh, yeah, so uh, I go back to work tomorrow. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It's gonna be a vacation compared to this. But I did enjoy myself and hopefully we have more vlogs coming up. I'm not sure how that's gonna work out now that I'm back to work, but I will try to keep you up to date on what's going on. And uh, if you like what you're seeing here and you want more stuff, uh, let me know in the comments below any questions that you have on all of the vlogs that I've put out up to this point about my adventures at home. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you again in the next video. Bye!